<laughs> Another one. No, 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 no. They don't get lucky. <laughs> Fine. I'll do it myself. <laughs> Welcome back, Bull fans. All right, let's go, Jason. Make us proud. No pressure. No pressure. <laughs> this remarkable match was a featured event in the Efren Reyes Benefit Tournament presented by Streetlights Billiards Academy and held in January 2023 in Virginia, United States. This match features Efren Reyes facing off against Jason Harris, a promising young pool professional hailing from America. This is a quick race to five in a nine ball game. The match started off with Jason's missed a defensive play, leaving Efren with a cut shot on the one ball. And so far Efren is maneuvering through the balls with a seamless precision. Moving on to Rock 2, Efren secured the first one and now has the break. Jason missed the one ball, leaving Efren snookered behind the seven and four balls. Now let's see how the magician handles this situation. What a precise kick shot. It was well executed, but unfortunately, Efren still didn't secure position on the two ball for his next shot. Let's see if he can execute a successful kick shot on the two ball next. <gasps> Efren managed to make a solid contact with the two ball, but he couldn't find cover. It was evident that Jason attempted a defensive shot, but to his dismay, he scratched. Efren now has ball in hand and will attempt to clear the remaining balls on the table. Don't forget to hit that like button if you've been enjoying the video so far. And as always, thank you for your support. But unexpectedly, Efren missed the long shot on the 7 ball here. And because of that, he handed this rack to his opponent. <gasps> this is rack 3, and the score is tied at 1 apiece. However, Jason scratched on the break. Efren is 68 years old as of the time of this tournament. <gasps> 
the Filipino player attempted a bank shot on the five ball but missed the mark. He has now left his opponent with an open shot and an open table. Moving on to Rock 4, Efren manages to pocket a ball on the break. However, he's left with a long shot on the 1. He opted for the thin cut but unfortunately, he scratched. Let's see if the young player can run the open table. Dear Pooh fans, kindly drop a comment below mentioning which part of the world you're tuning in from. It'll be great to know. We extend our heartfelt thanks to all our dedicated supporters out there. Here we go, entering Rock 5, the young player seems to be in control, leading with a score of 3 to 1. Jason tried a defensive shot on the 3 ball, but it didn't work out, leaving our friend with an open shot. Demonstrating his powerful stroke, Efren managed to draw the cue ball for ideal position on the three. From there, he smoothly and impressively run the entire balls on the table. We don't know who's gonna win. Yeah. Let's proceed to Rock 6. Efren executed a fantastic break, pocketing two balls and positioning himself perfectly for an easy shot on the one ball. Efren serves as a testament that age is merely a number in the realm of pool. As evident, he continues to perform exceptionally, showcasing remarkable cue ball control. But something unexpected happened here. <gasps> A costly miss by Efren on the 9 ball, leading him conceding this rock immediately. If you are a pool player, I'm sure you've experienced this, running all the balls except the 9 ball. It can be a frustrating feeling, but that's just how the game goes sometimes. Let's go back to the game. This is Rack 7 with the American player on the hill, 4-2. to two. And Jason made a significant error here, hitting the wrong ball first and giving Efren ball in hand. The young player shouldn't be overconfident here, as Efren is displaying no signs of giving up. Sometimes players tend to get overly confident when they're on the verge of victory. However, when you're up against a legend like Efren, it's crucial to remain focused and not afford him too many opportunities.
we are now in rack 8 and Efren is only trailing by one rack. The score stands at 4 to 3. Here, Efren executes a superb defensive play, compelling the young player to kick, but he fails to make contact. Now, the magician has the opportunity to level the score and bring this match to a heel heel situation. If you're a fan of Efren Reyes, drop a comment saying Efren Reyes Goat in the comment section below. You can also hit the like button on this video to show your support for the GOAT, Efren Reyes. And if you are new to this channel, now's your chance to hit that subscribe button. Oh my Make a pressure is good, like a nervous, no? Another miss on the 9 by the magician. Both players are struggling to put the 9 ball. The pressure is always seems to be on during the final ball, doesn't it, pool fans? But in the end, the magician pockets the nine ball. At last, pool fans, we've reached the final rack. The match is now tied, heading to a hill hill showdown. Jason executes a really impressive bank shot on the one ball, but he falls short on positioning for the two ball next. The match intensifies as both players employ cautious and defensive strategies. Who do you think will emerge victorious in this match, pool fans? Drop your predictions in the comments below. The excitement level rises as Efren finds himself snookered behind the 9 ball. And a young player has an opening here. Could he truly outplay the magician and pull off a win? Let's find out if he drops this final 9 ball. Oh my <laughs> <laughs> yeah, no, I got lucky. <laughs>
What a finale! The young player ultimately missed the final 9 ball, even though Jason conceded Efren still approached the table to treat the viewers with a trick shot. What an incredible match this has been, pool fans. The magician, true to form, never ceases to amaze. His prowess as a pool player endures through the years, proving that with passion and love for the game, the fire in your heart remains ablaze. Age is no barrier to showcasing our deep affection for this sport we all cherish. Thank you for joining us, pool fans. See you in the next match. God bless everyone.